Gene Gowan with the Chatham Journal, and I'm out here at the Northwood Track with Mr. Johnny Heath with General Maintenance. And Johnny, what are we doing out here? We're installing a new scoreboard for the high school this year. A new scoreboard? Yep. Because that's old scoreboard's in pretty bad shape, wasn't it? Yeah. Been more, I've worked on it several <laughs> times. It's going to be, uh, I think Cameron says, it's over 20 years old. Oh, okay. And you've been doing you've been doing lots of things in chat. This is not like the biggest job you've ever done. No, I've, I've recently retired from the University of North Carolina. That's what I did up there, school board maintenance and stuff. All right, so you can handle the everything. big stuff that's at UNC. So this isn't really that big. Yeah, we did video walls and everything. All right, let's let's. Uh, are we getting a video wall over here? No, <laughs> <laughs> the, not putting enough money down here. No, that's all right. Okay, so. This scoreboard you had mentioned is a bigger scoreboard than the old scoreboard. Yes. And Five by, feet more with that panel added and the archway put in. All right. So we have an archway that we didn't have on the old scoreboard. Right. All right. Is there anything else that you know that's on that scoreboard that the old scoreboard didn't have? It's got an add panel on the bottom, uh, but it's not electronic or anything. I think it's just going to be graphics put on it. All right. So, and this, the old board lasted 20 years. So is this board going to last that long, if not longer? It should last, yeah. It should last. Technology is much better than what they had. All right. Now, as a general contractor for this kind of stuff, you took down the old board, I see. Yep. And uh, you just put that in a recycling bin? I don't know what the school's going to do with it. I think they were going to try to surplus it or sell it. Okay. So it's still usable. It's still just, usable. It's still functional, yeah. It's just, it's... 20 years yeah, old. Yeah, we just unwired, well, you know, it's faded and rotted out, you know, uh, need repainting and surfacing, but it makes somebody a nice board. Right. Now, in preparation for this, you took down the board. What else do you need to get done to get this up and running? Well, we got our struts mounted to the bottom, but that's going to be the bottom of the board where you see the new pieces welded on. And, Can we um, go, go take a closer look yeah. at it? So it's this, it's the, it's, it's this piece welded on right here. Am I pointing at the right thing? All right. We'll start stacking the board. We gotta make make a few little brackets. The new boards get a little off, a little, little bit uh, off, a little bit for the, for the distant poles. Okay. So we are gonna make a few little brackets. And now you said you said several boards. Is it not one big scoreboard? This will be one scoreboard in the end. Once okay. You put it all together and stack it. So there's like a bunch of them. Yes. Is three, that them three over three there? Three pieces to make one. Oh, okay, I got you. So, yeah. So, and the archway will make four. All right. And, it, and it basically, elect, elect, electrical, is that all done, or do you have to do any rewiring? No, we're going to use existing. It's just got to all be re, rewired. You, we just put a new piece of flex back up, tied in. It already had existing power. It's all wireless. So once we, uh, biggest thing is wiring the horn back in and, and then syncing the controller to the new controller. Okay, so you said when it's wireless, you're saying you're not going to have wire running from the no. up there it's down here. Wireless. It's all wireless. Mm -hmm. Well, that's so pretty once nice. Once we sync everything, once we get everything in place and get it all, all synced together, it's going to make it real nice. Now, is this a one-day job or a multiple-day job? I uh, was hoping to get out of here today, but it's going to probably have half tomorrow better in it because, uh, like I said, we got to do a little altercation here. Okay. Well, that sounds good. Johnny, thank you for letting thank us you. know. And if anybody else needs services, your number is 919-218-1286. See, there yes, you go. Sir. That's Anytime. why you should have your phone number on your shirt. <laughs> All right, thanks, John. Appreciate it. Thank you.